all right so to create a variation model we need few fields right so in this case uh, for the variation model let's find out what are the fields we require so the first one is you know we should be able to add these colors or uh, we can say the values or we can say the you know the variation variation values or something like that and this color and size also we can say this is the variation uh, category okay so the one is the variation values and another one is variation category and the product itself okay so this product itself okay three main things here we need to handle and with these three fields we also need created date and is active and all those uh, uh, you know the standard stuff okay so let's create a model now uh, go to the store and the models okay uh, below this class product uh, let's make another class uh, variation and models dot model all right and now the product itself we need right the first thing we need is the product that is equal to product oh sorry not product it is models dot in this case foreign key okay why this is foreign key is because we are going to add the variation of this particular product right so that means of course we need this product as a foreign key right so that's why product equal to models foreign key and product comma and on delete equal to cascade okay cascade is because if this product is deleted then the variation should be deleted okay and next one uh, we need the variation category right variation category that is equal to models dot care field so let's make this as a drop down so that's why we will make first of all let's say max length is equal to 100 comma the choices is equal to let's make one choice here variation category underscore choice okay so this choice we need to do is equal to open a tuple and again a tuple and here uh, let's say first one is color okay comma color and comma open another tuple and let's say size comma size and this choice will go to here okay so that it will make a drop down list in the admin panel and next one is variation variation value that's equal to models dot field max length equal to 100 and what else we need is active uh, this is because if you want to disable any of the uh, variation value so we can do that from here uh, using the is active so this will be models dot boolean field okay so by default let's oh sorry default is equal to true okay by default the uh, variation is active okay and the last one will be created at created date we can say that is equal to models dot date time field then auto nav equal to true okay i think that's enough and let's make a string representation of this pro, uh, you know the model define underscore underscore str underscore underscore pass in the self and return self dot what let's return self dot uh, let's return this product okay and uh, we did this variation and we want this variation model to be shown in the backend right that's why I go to this admin admin dot pi here and here let's register this admin dot site dot register variation okay variation and this variation we should bring from the models okay product comma models so at this point we should do the make migration right okay name cascade is not defined on delete is equal to cascade no not like this go back to models.py and uh, this should be models dot cascade okay so th that was my mistake and let me go to here and uh, looks fine okay 
so let's uh, make migration now python manage dot py run server oh sorry not run server this is make migration right okay so python manage dot py make migrations and python manage dot py migrate all right uh, now uh, run server go to here and let me go to the admin now login and now we can see the variation model here so add variation okay so now we can add uh, the variation for these products right so let's let's add some product here i mean the variation here one is the first one the first product ats atx jeans and uh, for this let's add the color okay so in this case for the color let's say a red save what it is saying type error at str returned non-string okay we are returning the product here right as a str here let's say instead of this str we'll say unicode okay save this and let's refresh add variation and first one is color and let's say color uh, i mean the red save okay this is uh, now saved and again add atx jeans color blue and save and atx jeans color and green okay one more thing to notice here this one we don't want to want it to show like this right so that's why let's go to uh, here admin.py file and let's make one class variation admin so admin dot model admin all right uh, here let's uh, list display some of the fields okay copy and paste the above code and uh, in this case we need we need the product right product and the price uh, not price need the category okay and the variation value and let's make uh, is active also here okay that's enough and uh, remove all of them if you refresh here now you can no uh, we should uh, register this uh, class here okay and put that there and refresh now you can see this product variation category and this is these are all the values and i i want this is active to be uh, working here from here okay i don't if if i want to uh, disable this red and i can uh, do this from I, I should be able to do this from here okay so that's why what i'll do is i'll say list editable is equal to uh, is add active and make sure you put the comma here okay because uh, that is the tuple right so you can't uh, uh, leave one value here without the without the comma okay and refresh okay and now you can see this this can be uh, you know this can be editable from here just save this and now this is active and inactive okay all right and uh, uh, here I I at this place i want one uh, you know i want uh, the, the filter box okay so let me go back to the admin and let's say list filter list underscore filter is equal to copy this one and paste it here let's filter by the product name and the variation category variation value okay that's all and go to here refresh now we are able to uh, filter uh, with the by product by the variation category and all those stuff okay so uh, this is i think this is enough for now uh, let's not make a long video okay let's um, make it uh, part by part so that it can be easy if you 
uh, if you want to come again and see this video okay so let's stop here and we'll continue in the next one